Morning, Jay, Nicholas, and Chris Daughters at the Caddis Fly. We're doing some egg flies here, and this one is pretty cool. Uh, using a steelhead uh, or a, a boss fly, Daiichi boss fly hook. You know, and this hook reminds me of that was a really popular hook. Was that 800 B? You remember that? Yes. TMC hook. Yes. 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 This, this particular hook is one I just love to use on my comets, and I use this for tube flies. If you haven't tried this for tube flies, you're missing out. It's worth having in your arsenal. Slight, very slightly downturned eye. Not way down, not ring eye. Uh, so we've got some pearl, tiny dab of cement there. You could, year, you could use clear cure goo oh yes on your eyes uh, so th this is a this is a kind of interesting uh, I'm calling it an egg pattern because you can indeed dead drift it under an indicator you can fish it in tandem with larger or smaller um, nymphs you can also swing it so this is arctic fox tail so it, it's kind of cool because you uh, with you can fish it without an indicator. You can chuck it into a little pocket and drift it through that pocket, high stick, and then uh, let me find some crystal flash here. I'm going to edge this tail with a couple strands of crystal flash. Anyway, you can high stick it through a little pocket, and then you can let it swing around. Uh, and uh, fish are as likely to take it as it's dead drifting as when it's swinging. So now here we have uh, so pink, pink tail arctic fox could use marabou, sure. Um, little crystal flash enhancer. Uh, the the pearl eyes with this. This is a fluorescent white. Chenille, just really nice contrast. I'm going to throw on a pink. Uh, this is saddle, this is webby saddle, so schlappen would work really well also. A lot of hackle here, just a little bit. And I know it's extra work to put these things, wind these hackles in by the tip, but that's just the way I do things, so. You want to tie it in by the butt, be my guest. The fish will be perfectly happy with it, with the result. So, pink tail, pink hackle, flow, white, body. All this work to get that one little hackle out of the way. And then, fluorescent orange chenille for your head. And now it's, it's always, you know, it's nice to have a standardized routine for how you tie on these heads around barbell eyes. So forward on the far side, around towards you all the way, around on the mid side, over all the way, and I have a wild hackle in there. over and I'm going to go over a second time just to bulk it up and then I'm going to come under and I'm going to do twice there and if my eyes were tied closer to the eye of the hook I would have just gone around once in front finish that off I see one little hackle that is where it's not supposed to be so I'm going to try to snip him There you go. Great steelhead egg and swinging fly.